how to add a search bar in WordPress menu. Hi guys, welcome back to another video. And in today's video, I'm going to be telling you how you can add a search bar in WordPress. So having said that, let's just jump into the video. So over here, as you can see, I'm on my dashboard in WordPress. And what we need to do is we need to set up a couple of things. We need to set up, you know, our website and stuff like that. So we need to download above some plugins. So we're going to go ahead and show you what plugins that you need to add so in the install plugin section you're going to want to install a elementor plugin and a astra or spectra i think that's the name the starter templates and you want to add astra widgets as well so these are the things that you want to add and once you've added them you should be good to go and then you can go ahead and install a template which looks something like this as you can see it looks pretty cool so this is the template that i'm using right now so you can go ahead and add it into your website so now once you've added all of these important plugins next step for you to do is to go ahead and add the search bar now to add the search bar it's actually very simple open up your website right and let's say you want to click on customize we customize it and in this section right here this is the style guide here you can go ahead and change the website colors the headings and all of that right what we want to do is we want to click on actually we want to go back we want to actually edit the page not the entire website we want to edit the page because that is more important we'll click on edit page and here is where things get interesting here what you want to do is you want to click on this little button over here and this plus button this blue plus button and it'll open up this library where you have a bunch of different options here you want to scroll down and you will have the search button here this will add a search widget to let users search post from your website so you can just simply go ahead and add it by just simply dragging and dropping it wherever you want so we want to upload it at the top so we'll go ahead and go at the top for some reason it went to the bottom we don't want to do that we'll add it right here right here we'll add the search bar and type and hit enter so i think that looks good you can add the style uh, you can move it around a little bit if we could upload it over here i think that would be much good but i don't think we can so over here i think it looks good you can even uh, move it down here so when people come over to your website uh, they can scroll down and they will find it over here but it depends on you where you want to place it after that you should be good to go after that just hit the save button and there you go now let's go ahead and click on view page and check out the bar so as you can see it went back over there i don't think that's what we wanted so let's go ahead and fix this shall we we'll move it a little bit better next time so we'll go ahead and go back to the customization section and here we'll just select the bar and click on this button to move it down here i think that would be a much better place to have that search bar i think it would be much better if i could place it somewhere over here so let me actually see if i can i don't think i can yeah i don't think i can so we'll just leave it at that if we click over here can we create something else if we search for search so we also have this one as well so this is an also this is the legacy version adds a search widget to let and helps visitor find your content so then we have two different ones so you can choose whichever one you want and let's go ahead and search for navigation so we will actually go ahead and add this one as well this one actually looks much better if we move it up top it's going to take a little bit while i think this one actually might just be it so we can see over here these are the two ones right search placeholder this one has change button positions as well so we can go ahead and move it inside button should be inside google search label so over here we can change that and we can make it bigger and smaller we click on these three buttons we can change the create a pattern lock it or group it with something as well so if we click on group what would that happen okay it actually made something else but i think we should remove this one for now delete that this looks good and instead of maybe grouping it i'll click on ungroup to ungroup it we can lock it over here as well but let me see if i can change up this text right here so in the block we have settings width and in advance we have our own options but yeah i think this looks good let me actually go ahead and save this change and now we'll go ahead and view the page over here and see how it looks like so here we have the search button i think this is much better this is good we have our header at the top scroll down we have the search bar uh, although this looks weird with the uh, side cutouts let me search for something 
anything new i'll search for it see what happens so yeah search results for new all of the new things are going to be over here whenever so yeah i think it works it works so if i search for fertilization what would happen if i just simply search for it so here we go yeah search results for fertilization so since i don't have any content added into my website that's why it's not popping up but i'm pretty sure if you add stuff to it you can go ahead and add it now for some reason i don't like this our big button over here what is that i think this is it width i can increase the width full width none i think maybe if we go with wider i think that looks much better and we click on move to i don't know and i think this looks good we can even add more blocks to it if we want but i think this looks good we have the position and advance option as well sticky this block will stick to the top of the window instead of scrolling if we do that uh, i think that would also look pretty good let me just go ahead and save it come over here reload the page so here we go so as you can see if we scroll down we have it the sticky bar right here so it looks pretty good yeah that looks much better now if we want to put it up here first have to go ahead and add the header so if we search for header we can see we have a bunch of different options we have simple header with dark background with full background so if we click over here and we just put that over there so i think that's something but it's way too big uh, but i think if we want to add a header we should go ahead and edit it in the other section not this section so we'll first we'll remove it we'll remove it there we go i think this looks good we'll save it come over here reload it check out how it looks like it's loading up give it a couple of seconds and yeah i think this looks good so yeah this is how you can add a search bar into your wordpress website and how you can even make it sticky as well all right so another thing that you can do with this search bar is that you can add it into your navigation bar at the top right how do you do that well it's pretty simple uh, instead of editing this page right uh, like we did last time we go to customize we go into the main customization of the entire website here we will have a bunch of different options so here what you want to do is click on header builder right here you click on header builder it's going to open up right here now uh, you can see as i move my mouse you have these plus icons right in the plus icon you will have the search option click on search and the search option will be added into the navigation bar now it doesn't look good right so we should move these things around to make it more you know better looking so to do that i think i'll move the search bar right somewhere here and so that it doesn't intrude on anything so we'll just move it there and these buttons will move them no instead of the button we'll get that here and i think that looks much better uh, yeah there you go get a quote i think we'll move the buttons here primary menu should be here a search would be here and yeah i think that looks good there you go i think that looks much better you can also make this search button live search as well so over here you can see live search you click on it and now you will have posts you don't want floating buttons so we'll turn that off you have posts and pages that way whenever someone types on the search bar uh, they will have live answers so let's go ahead and see how this one looks so if we just simply click on publish or click on save that happened as well now let's go ahead and check it out so if we click on the search bar it opens up like so and now if we just type whatever we want we will have live options right here so as you can see we have options right here we can just simply go ahead and select these pages and yeah so very simple this is how you do it uh if you want you can move it around however you want to so if you want you can move it here so that way it doesn't cover up the entire menu options or what you can do is for example if we click over here we'll move the uh primary menu option we'll move it here all right we'll move it in the center that way we have enough space for our search bar which i think is pretty cool and also make the search bar icon a little bit bigger so that it doesn't there you go much better and we can also increase the width of that as well which you know come over there another thing uh we can just simply move this here and i think that I, that looks much better so now we'll just simply click on publish close that up check it out how it looks there you go it looks much better we should maybe make it a little bit smaller but you know uh, this is how you do it this is how you add a search bar into your wordpress website so very simple this is how you do it this is how you add a wordpress search bar and you can also add a live search bar in your wordpress website so having said that thank you guys for watching and i hope to see you guys in the next video and until next time take care and goodbye